October 2022 moon phases, the full moon for this month will occur in the second week on Sunday October 9th and is in the astrological sign, Libra. The new moon will happen later in October on Tuesday October 25th. The first quarter moon for this month can be seen on October 3rd, with a visibility of 56%. The first quarter moon is a primary moon phase when half of the moon's face is lit up. Whether it is the left or right half depends on where you are on Earth. The ocean tides on Earth are mostly generated by the moon's gravitational pull. At the first and third quarter, the moon and sun pull in different directions, producing the smallest difference between high and low tide, known as neaps or neap tide. During this phase, Spend extra time making decisions and take the time to sit back and reflect on any decisions you have made in life, what did they mean to you and what did you learn from them? October's full moon will be visible on October 9th and is commonly called the Hunter's Moon, hearkening back to European and Native American traditions where hunters would use the light of the full moon to track down their prey and stock up for the coming winter. This is the focal point of October 2022 moon phases. Like each month's full moon throughout the year, it brings an ending and a new beginning. But it's not just about the moon cycle, the full moon is a time for a change in your life as well. Contrary to popular belief, the hunter's moon isn't actually bigger or brighter than usual. It simply rises earlier, soon after sunset, which would give hunters plenty of bright moonlight to hunt by during the early evenings. To neo-pagans, however, the hunter's moon is known by a far more morbid name, the blood moon. It is thought that the hunting story behind the October moon is also why it's sometimes referred to as the blood moon. Are we affected by a full moon? The moon is an important player in astrology, as it's considered the planet of emotions, moods, and memories. When the moon is full, it can bring all of our emotions to the surface and amplify them whereas new moons are more calm and reflective periods. Much like the moon is responsible for the ebb and flow of tides, because our brains are a significant source of water, Dutch researchers hypothesize the moon's gravitational pull could similarly have an effect on our brain, causing erratic behavior. The stronger your connection to the full moon, the more your heart chakra is aligned. Your heart chakra is home to kindness and forgiveness. This means that a full moon is actually the perfect time to let go of negativity. So, it is important to understand all of the October 2022 moon phases in order to know how the universe is affecting you. The last quarter moon will be visible at 53% on October 17th. A last quarter moon appears half lit by sunshine and half immersed in its own shadow. It rises in the middle of the night, appears at its highest in the sky around dawn and sets around midday. During this phase you become aware of what is and is not working with respect to the achievement of your goal for the cycle. Action is essential, either take a correcting action or make the final push needed to realize a successful outcome. The question is, where do I go from here? At this point, you should recognize your mistakes and should be rewarded for your accomplishments. The new moon will be visible at only 1% on October 25th. The darkness of a new moon is a time for reflection and exploring the unseen. This is a time we usually experience sudden insights and develop new ideas. It is a great time to be creative and participate in writing, painting or anything else that allows the mind to be inspired. Write down what you're looking to call into your life over the next two weeks and what dreams and schemes you would like to make manifest over the course of the next six months. This new moon brings about a time of calmness and balance, while also bringing energy and acceptance that anything can be accomplished. Pundit Pete has a unique way of interpreting tarot cards. His readings strive to help people understand what might be happening in their lives. So many people don't have access to therapy, so Pete uses the images of the cards to bring up something that would trigger relevance in your life that might need acting upon. Pete shows us that there is always more than one truth to every situation. Alternative viewpoints can help us understand what is really happening. Pundit Pete uses these online cards as his tools of introspection. The magic of Pundit Pete's free daily tarot card readings shows how the cards give you the confidence to unlock and confront feelings that you otherwise wouldn't and prepares you for realizing there are different ways of solving problems. 
it is good to consider that things might not be exactly what you associate them with and there are other ways of understanding why things happen the way they do. Why not see what Pundit Pete sees in your cards, it's free. Join us at www.secretserendipity.com where great insights reveal deep discoveries. Where great insights can impact future choices and attitudes. Where we strive for a deeper understanding of the power of the universe.